welcome to my channel so this is Fergie and welcome to my vlog so this would be my 2.1 house tour because we have done our house tour last time which is nasa link sa baba ang aking house tour for that so technically we have done our house renovation during uh, uh, during the COVID season. No? For first floor na muna yung natapos. So, the original plan of this house is hanggang second floor. Though we have a second floor, but at the moment, we decided, no, na the house tour na lang muna ang first floor since we don't know yet when will be our next house renovation. So, let's get started. <music> Um, these are carnation, ayan, ganyan natin. And I forgot what's the name of this. This is lavender. And itong kalaseya. And this one is gifted from the neighbor. So on this side, we decided to have a sliding door para if we wanted to, you know, unwind a bit, no, at night. So from the dining, ito na siya. May di uh, sliding door na siya agad. So pasok na tayo dito sa aming sala. And I would like to flaunt my very cute unicorn slipper. So this is the one that I'm wearing um, pag nasa bahay ako. So, tayo. So this, uh, if you remember last time, this is our uh, TV console which is really painted. Kasi I still want the touch of marble. And then we just added some, um, ano tawag nito? Itong mga fixtures. Fixtures ba tawag niya? Itong mga some jars and this one. So we bought this one from Mandawe. So these are from Mandawe. 400 ata. Then ito 300. Then, since we are converting the uh, idea of we want a Muji um, theme or something like wood and um, something more on plants. So we converted some of the touch up ng area na wood siya. So like here, um, Ito, we bought a laminate which is around 1,000 each. Isang plywood na siya guys. Parang singlaki siya ng, ng isang, um, ano tawag dyan? Um, yung plywood, you know. So, isang ganun, you have to buy it in City Hardware which is 1,000 yung isang sheet. So, instead of um, repainting it, if you remember last time, this was color black and white. So, nilagyan na lang namin siya ng laminated. Uh, laminate. So, this was done by my husband. So, I'm just so proud no, to say that this was, we don't have any interior designer this time. Whatever you can see around the corner was created by me and Raymond. So, ito, I bought the, the pots from my cousin. So, ilagay ko din yung ano niya. Then, ito, it was gifted by her. C, uh, A, C, and S Garden. So, siya nagbigay kasi she loves plants. And then, this one is, um, we bought it um, in City Hardware, which is yung isang ganyan niya, is around 300 pesos. So, very uso to yung mga ganito. And so, um, this one, nirithay namin to, which is, I told you before, I just bought this one for 800 pesos sa Gaisano Mall of Tagum. And of course, hindi siya pricey if you will hold this one. Parang plastic lang siya. So, di ba, we can still come up with the elegant design by not spending so much money on it. Itong Monstera, I bought from iPlant Studio, which is Brian Kainglet. Lalagay ko din ang kanyang um, link sa baba. And this one, we repainted it white. So, para ano lang, um, para lang magbago yung hitsura niya. If you remember last time, we had this beige um, couch. Very small. And usually, parang dalawa or tatlong tao lang yung kasha doon. So, hindi kami nang hinayang to let it go kasi nilagay naman namin siya sa dalawang 
um, milk tea stores and shops namin, which is I will reveal in the page or in the channel soon. So, ayan, binili na lang namin to sa SM, I think around, um, I forgot how much is it, it is. Basta nasa SM siya. Ayan, I think nasa 28,000 if I'm not mistaken. And then, this one, we bought it from, ito na yung old ko dati na curtains, then pinalita lang namin ng ganito. And then, this one, uh, we bought it from Lazada. I, our coffee table. So, upo ako sa glit. Sa ating coffee table, we bought it uh, in Mandawe for around 2,000 plus na lang. Dahil nakasale naka siya. I think that was 4,000. So, ang gusto ko sa kanya, it achieves the um, wood concept of our uh, house team. And then, bumili lang ako ng mga ganito. Ayan, yung mga parang banig. Anong tawag dito? Ratan ba yan? Para whatever, kasi diba yung sala is andito lahat yung mga kids, mga bisita, and some of our like, ito, like yung mga cap, or mga umbrella, or minsan mga unwanted na mga things na we don't want it to show sa sala. Eh, syempre ito yung pinaka-common na area. So, I bought this one, tip yun, para dito nyo nalang ilagay lahat yung mga mess, or yung mga things na you need daily para, mat para matakpan siya. And then, uh, so, sa taas naman tayo. Shhh. Ayan. So, this um, light, like, on sale siya. Yun yung pinaka-tip ko sa inyo, guys, is that you, if you want something, no, mag-antay ka talaga na dumating yung sale, sale day niya. Parang, di ba, atis nakamura kami. Sobrang mura namin siya nabili. And then, ayan, pinadagdagan na lang namin ng cove light sa above. And of course, this one, again, we bought it from Mandawe. And this one is from Mandawe. So, just to, to make a breaker, we, we added something like this. Para lang, alam mo yun, may touch of brass and ano pa rin siya. And this one, para meron kang king, ano, king batawang yan. Lagi ko muna yung phone. Ayan. So, this is sa Mandawe din to. And on this corner, um, ayan, again, we bought this one from Mandawe. And ito, super nagustuhan ko itong glass na um, table, console table because it has the wood and the glass um, uh, material which is I think that's what compromises our theme. Merong glass, merong wood and something white and marble. Yun yung gusto kong i-achieve kasi. Dito na corner, ayan, I have this Calatea and this one is an uh, elephant ear, ear elephant ear na plant which is Medyo may pinagdadaanan siya ngayon, kaya dyan na muna siya. So, we put our shoes behind this stairs, which well, hindi ko muna papakita kasi medyo kind of dirty. Ayan, come dito. And another wise thing to do, if you want to recreate a new looking for your um, stairs, so, kasi we really want to achieve a wood effect. And instead of repainting it, kasi ang hirap i-achieve ng ganito, we found this vinyl. Sobrang cool niya, guys. Kasi yung isang ganito, parang ganyan na siya kalaki. It's just around 26 pesos. And yung isang ganito, parang tatlo lang yung mag-amin na. So, makakatipid ka talaga. So, nilagyan na lang namin siya ng ganyan para at least magmukhang wood pa rin yung effect niya. O, ba Nakasave na tayo dyan. So, dito tayo sa room ni Rose. So, sa room ni Rose, if you remember last time, medyo nag-chip off na yung mga paint dito. And um, last time kasi, naging store stock room to dito. So, ang pangit na. Sobrang liit ng area namin dati yung stock room to. So, lahat ng mga gamit nandito sa loob. So, hindi siya nagagamit. And tayo. Ayan. So, ito yung room ni Rose ngayon. So, I decided to have a double deck na room para kasi we love to invite visitors and then um, at least dito siya dito yung mga pamangkin ko minsan or yung mama at papa ko or whoever na gusto yung sinong pumunta dito then wala pa yung home kasi bibilhin pa namin and of course we have she has this coffee table wala pang flower which is nalimutan lang siguro and of course ayan pinagawang ko siya ng Ayan, um, ano tawag nito? Cabinets para dito na lahat yung mga gamit niya or some of our stuffs na hindi na, um, like, ano, hindi, hindi, mga ginagamit pala. So, andito yung mga ano. And then, I want to flaunt this beautiful, um, ano tawag nito? 
wall mural created by Gabby and Rose. So, sila yung, ako lang yung nagganon, tapos sila yung nagpaint. Kasi, sabi nga ni Rose sa akin, te, sobrang bare if we will just have it white. So, sabi ko, okay, naghanap kami sa Pinterest yung mga, ano, yung mga inspiration that we really wanted to come up. So, ako na nagganon ng lapis, tapos sila na yung nagpaint. So, um, I'm so happy with the outcome kasi hindi mas siya professional looking but it was a touch of the two of them. So, I'm so proud of them na ganito yung naging outcome niya. So, ayan, dito yung kanyang, ayan, dito, dito aakyat ang kanya ang, ayan, dyan, dyan aakyat, paakyat doon, sige, ganun mo, ayan, paakyat doon. To maximize the space, ito, may, may, mukhang mahirap siya, basta ayan siya. May tatlo siyang drawer wherein we have put all our mga towels, um, curtain. I'm proud to say na, ayan, we also bought this um, dining table from Mandawe. And um, sobrang tip pa na nagawa namin. Kasi usually, if you're gonna buy a um, dining table, um, pricey na siya at 30000 And usually, it's just thir uh, six seaters. And then, hindi ganito kalapad yung kanilang um, table. So, nag-ikot-ikot kami. We are so patient, no? Sa pagpili ng mga furnitures. Kasi, we really believe na itong bahay na to will be our forever house na rin. So, I really believe na it's worth of our time and effort in searching for the right furnitures na gagamitin namin. So, actually, itong table na to is really an office table, conference table. And, yung dito niya, yung paan niya was color white dati. So, nag-repaint na lang namin siya ng black. So, 10K to. And then, ito, itong mga chairs niya, nabili namin, kaya nakasya yung walo. Which is a great um, number for us, especially na big family. Small family lang naman kami mag-asawa. But, I considered ourselves as big family kasi marami kaming friends and mga kasama sa work and um, sa business. Of course, ito sa Mandawe. Ayan, may share tayo. Para, ito kasi is direct na to siya. Itong dining is direct na siya sa ating pool area. Ayan. So, actually, sana pala mas maliliit na mga frames na anim or nine para mas marami pa kami pictures. But I think this one is already decent enough. What can you say? Comment naman kayo sa baba. So, um, in-achieve ko yung uh, black and white na, na pictures para I think it's cute na black and white yung kanyang ano. And then, this one, binili din namin sa City Hardware. I think 2K lang or 3K. Mura lang din to guys para hindi din puro chandelier yung bahay. Ano pa rin siya? Uh, may, may wood vibe pa rin siya. And then of course, ito, I'm proud to say na this plant was given by my um, previous secretary. So, ayan, giant photo siya. Tapos, binilang ko na lang itong Coco Pit. And then, um, ayan, with the plant. Uh, ayan. Tapos, may planter na lang siya na nagayan. And ito pala, guys, um, one of the tip that we made. Since, no last time kasi, super white lang siya. And it looks so bare. So, ayan, um, mga hakto. Ito siya is uh, laminate, which is bought from um, City Hardware. I believe there are some, if wala kayong City Hardware sa place nyo, try to ask some hardwares kung sino nagbebenta ng mga laminate ang tawag doon. So, yung laminate kasama niya to and the marble one. So, ito, imbes na semento siya, um, tinapakan na lang namin siya ng laminate na wood um, effect para mas wood effect yung bahay. Kasi if we will gonna buy a yung super malaki na kahoy, sobrang pricey and expensive. So, pwede naman natin gawa ng paraan para mag-looking, ano pa rin siya, uh, wood-looking pa rin siya. Ayun, so tip ko lang naman yun sa inyo. And, let's proceed to my kitchen. Ayan.
official. This is my coffee tape, uh, coffee maker, which is gifted to me by my um, Ninang sa wedding. So that she's also my professor in school before. And ito yung mga hindi naman mga mamahalin, mga some rum and wine collections ni Remo na bawasan na to. Kasi hindi naman kami pala inong both. It's just that we need it some, some time, no? If you wanted to have a date or may mga surprise visitors na needed na, alam mo yun, maserve ng mga wines. And andito ang mga wine glass. And pasensya na, meron pang pera dyan at resibo. Um, yung tiles is we decided to make it a marble um, design para wala lang gusto ko lang ng marble and of course this is one of the art piece that I'm very proud of dito sa bahay kasi I'm the one who come up with this idea so technically the first the original uh, plan was to buy a new range hood but I re uh, and if you buy a new range hood na so 16,000 yung pinakamura na yung gusto ko yung ganito yung hitsura niya guys no but since um, we have the existing range hood last time, oh, diba? Chereng, oh, diba? So this is just the old range hood, which is mahat kabuk pa siya. This is the old range hood that we had. And then, sabi ko kay kinakuya na, how about creating a parang ganito chimney looking? Tapos lagyan na lang siya ng hinges. Para kunwari, malaki ang aming range hood. But actually, yung mumurahin lang siya na range hood, o diba? Area is yung ating lutuan whatsoever. So, this is... Um, and I really wanted to have an industrial looking na lutuan. Kaya pinush namin to even though I had an existing um, uh, oven. Kasi sabi ko naman, if may mga party and events, magagamit din naman yun. Tsaka magagamit din naman to. So, and this one is from Nick and Mama... Uh, from Nico's mother. Benta niya to. Japan surplus. Sobrang cool, di ba? And then, this one I bought from Lazada. I think 100 plus lang itong issue. Di ba? Nag-disclose ako sa inyo. Para malaman nyo na hindi lahat ng mga gamit ko ay expensive. Halos lahat ay mura. And this one is from SM. And this one is dati ko pa ata to na from Singapore. Ka, pa dinala ko dito. And ayan ang aking mga kamote collections. And of course, if you remember last time, Yung dating nandun ko na marble na painting, dito ko na lang siya nilagay para to match the theme of the kitchen since I want to push something white brass and marble. And then, ito, since wala na dito yung mga ano, huwag nyo na lang tingnan yan kasi it's very dirty. Ay, nagdaming ants. So, andito yung mga, ayan, so lapit mo ang tigab. So, ayan yung mga aming, um, plates and platito and kutsara and tinidor ayan ito siya so dito na lang and then yung the rest is yung mga maliliit na mug so, like, eh, gusto ko talaga siyang i-achieve so sa Lazada to binili and itong mga brass type na mga hawakan no um, I just bought it in city hardware for I think 80 pesos each oh diba taray and of course there, these are the existing item that I had already in my um, biggest vlog. So, ito pa rin yung aking flower. Ayan. And then, we have this. And, ayan. This corner, ito pa rin yung existing namin na oven, which is, as I mentioned, um, ginagamit na namin to if we want to bake some food. So, and if my party at least, marami ang ating lutuan, hindi tayo mahihirapan. And, ito yung pinakamalaking, eh, ba yung last time hanggang dun na. So, ito, isa to sa extension na ginawa. So, this is my current fridge. Ito pa rin yun. Walang pinagbago. Baka gusto nyo mag-sponsor a two-door uh, fridge. So, just email me on my email. Shout out. And then, on this side, ayan, andito yung ating lagay ng mop and ang ating basurahan. And then, kami pa ni JD kasi hindi siya kasya sa labahat. So, if he wants to go out, ayan yung mga bike niya. And then, of course, ito yung um, dalawang cabinets that I have asked the contractor to, ano, to do para dito namin ilagay lahat ng mga kitchen um, items namin and utensils na hindi nagagamit or gusto namin gamitin in the future. And of course, this is JD's playroom and study room that I was gonna uh, tour you on my next vlog so please abang abang kasi I'm so proud kasi it's my project and Gabby's project as well and so that's it for my house tour so abangan nyo ang aking 
um tawag yan, vlog for JD's room and his playroom. So I just want to leave this Bible verse to you para sa encouragement to those people who are aspiring to have their own house. Sabi dito sa Psalms 127, 1 to 2, Unless the Lord builds the house, its builder labor in vain. In vain you rise early and stay up late, toiling for food to eat, for he, got, he grants sleep to those he loves. So, and I really want to give all the glory and honor to our Almighty God because He has the one you know, who blessed us, who has given us the ability to produce wealth. And um, we really want to acknowledge all His goodness in our lives, guys. Though it's not yet fully finished, but we are just so blessed and thankful uh, to God na He really blessed our family and He really opened doors for us unexpectedly. That's why we have decided na um, at least, pagandahin man, kumuha kami ng portion ng aming naipon na mapaganda man lang ang aming bahay para din uh, mas comfortable kami mag-asawa to work out and to do the things that we love to do. So, yun lang yung pinaka-verse ko na um, to those couples that are aspiring, no, that are wanting to have their own business or their own house or building their own uh, family, um, just acknowledge the Lord in everything that you do because He is the one who will gonna bless all the works of our hands. No, apart from Him, we can do nothing. So that's why, because we can we can do so many things, we can do so many, we can come up with so many ideas. But the question is, uh, is the Lord will gonna be with us or against us? So do namin na realize ni Raymond na every step of the way, one of the reasons that. We are so victorious in everything that we do because everything, every plan is really committed unto Him. And that's why nagugulat na lang kami na every doors that we're trying to knock and we're trying to open, si Lord na lang mismo yung nag-open for us. So I hope na continue to encourage yourself if you're down, if meron kayong plano for your house and not yet fully done. Be patient because like kami, it took a while for us. Meron na kami na ipon last time but hindi mo na kami agad-agad nagpa-expand ng bahay because lack of budget pa. So you just have to keep on praying and pushing and sabi nga nila, ang house is liability not an asset but for me it's an asset because this is uh, where my family lives and this is the reason why I need to wake up every day and hustle, no? And do my, my, my work para lalo akong ganado na pagtrabahuan. And more on that is acknowledge the presence of God in your daily lives kasi one day, as long as you do your part, as long as you commit everything unto the Lord, and of course, you have to be excellent in everything that you do, magugulat ka na lang na you will wake up one day having the the prayers and the dream you have been praying for a long time. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog and don't forget to subscribe on my channel, click the thumbs up and share it to your Facebook. Till my next vlog, see you! Bye!